Hello beautiful people of YouTube. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a video uh, tutorial uh, using the Urban Decay Vice 4 palette. For the sake of time, I already did one eye and I think I, it came out pretty damn good. Here's what I came up with. Um, I used three or four colors. Um, I primed my eyes with the It Bye Bye Under Eye Corrector Concentrator Cream. Then I put the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk on my eyelid. I have it on right now because when you use colors, this works really well. So I put that on. Then I put the NYX Concealer in Beige on and set it with the NYX HD powder in banana and used my IT gel eyeliner and the L'Oreal Miss Manga Rock Voluminous Mascara. So we already did one eye for the sake of this video so now we are going to do the other eye. Um, so yeah we're going to be using the Vice 4. So what I did was I started off with Makeup Geeks Peach Smoothie, and I just took that and, come on, I have so many brushes in front of me, it's not even funny. I love this Urban Decay Vice 4 palette more than any other palette that they came out with. Oh, I, okay, I took Peach Smoothie and put it all over my lids. I hope the lighting is okay. It is really early in the morning, like the sun's just coming up. So I just ran it like all over my lid, all the way up, just bam. Um, I'm, I'm going to do swatches of this palette as well. And then my next uh, palette look and swatches will be the Lorac Mega Pro. So I just took Peach Smoothie and just put it all over my lid. Then what I did. Fanabla. At least there's no interruptions today. Hopefully. Now we're going to go in with the Vice 4. And I just love this freaking packaging. And the colors are phenomenal. I did like a pink and orange and black. Like a black like wing type out. That's why I have the tape on my eyes. So then I went in with the Kala. I went in with the Makeup Geek Pointed Crease Brush and I took the color Bitter, which is like a, I'll do swatches, you guys will see. And I just ran that through my crease. Legit, like all the way, just bam. Going past the tape, I just ran it all the way through. Yeah, it's called Bitter. When I first got this palette, I thought the names weren't on it, and I'm like, fuck, but they're on it. A lot of drama going on on YouTube, people. This chick, Aaliyah Marie, and her friend Keegan Zuris will not leave me and my friends alone. Um, so I'm just going to let it go. I don't give a shit about the chick anymore. I'm done. Done, 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 so I just wanted to put that video up to explain what she did. Now I'm just blending that color out. Then I went in with the color. What did I do next? Fuck, I forgot already. Oh, I went in with the duh. The color, what do you call it? Flame? Flame, baby, flame. It's like a sparkly orange color. And I put that all over my lid. It looks pink, but it's not. The fucking lighting is ruining it. So I put that all over my lid. Then I took Fast Fastball, which is pink. These are shimmers, both of these colors. And I put that like right right there. I put both of those colors on my lid. See? Okay. Like that. Yeah. 
Then Mama blended it out. Gotta blend, gotta blend. Oh, fuck. Okay, then I took the Makeup Geek Outer V brush and picked up the color Delete. Delete, delete, and put it in the Outer V. Creating that Outer V shape. This brush is phenomenal for that. If you need a good one. And then I just blended that out. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Working it in, working it in. We still got to do the whole face, so we ain't done yet, people. Then I took, then I took, then I took <laughs> my It Angled Liner Brush and the color, what do you call it, Deadbeat? I know a deadbeat, and I need to concentrate on this, and I just put it on, like, the tape. As close to the tape as possible. I'm telling you guys, use tape. It's phenomenal. I'm sure you all do anyway, but if you don't, don't know what you're messing, people. Yep, then I just took that and then I just blended some more. Just blended this color like up, you know what I'm saying? Just blended it out a bit. Because we didn't want it like too harsh, but we wanted it there. And then I went back in with the color. I took the Makeup Geek Outer V brush again and went back in with the color. Bitter and went back in the crease again. Phenobla, can you see this shit or what? Fuck me running. The lighting, it's like the sun's just coming up. Oh, and then we need to blend again. I'm gonna get closer so you can see. See, see, see. Yeah, just keep on blending. That's the key. It may look like I'm blending fast, but trust me, I am not. Phenomenal. Then I took, what did I take? What did I take? I'm the same outer V, but... Outer V brush, I took the color Framed. And kind of lightened up the crease a little bit. Just a bit. You'll see in a minute what I mean. Because if you do too dark, too dark. If you do too dark of a color, you can go in with a lighter shade of a shadow and just fix it on up, girls. Okay, then we're going to go and get some more of our fire, our flame, because we lost it. And our soft, our fastball, I was going to say fucking softball. Was that on d -Did? Zen. What did I do then? <laughs> oh, then I took the highlight framed. Put that shit under the brow bone. E e I like going all the way under my brow bone, people. Hell yeah. This is probably still going to be a long ass video, but I don't care. Then, then I took the color Bones. Because it just looked pretty. 
and put a little bit like right here. Just a tad, just a smidgen. Then I took fastball on the lower left. Let me take this fucking tape off. Ow! Ow. You guys don't know how bad that hurts. Come on, get off me. Fastball and flame and put it on the lower lash line. Oh, there's so many looks you can do with this palette. I love it. Picking up some more of Deadbeat. And fixing that line, baby. Like where the tape was, you know what I mean? So yeah, that's my little get ready with me. My little tutorial. I ain't done yet. I still gotta do my whole dang face. But that's pretty much what I did for the eyes. And then I took the bones and put it in my inner corner as well. So yeah. That is my look using the Urban Decay Vice 4 palette. I'll get up closer. Hang on just a second. These brushes, I'm going to clean them because they are dirty as a mofo. And I just freaking cleaned them. Jeez. Beauty is... It's fun, but it's a lot of work, people. You know what I mean? I got to throw it this way. Banaba. I'm going to get close to so you can see, see? Isn't it pretty? Okay, then I took the, like I said, the NYX HD Concealer in Beige. And just went right here. And triangle fucking motion. And I took my... Real Techniques Contour Brush, and I put way too much concealer on, but oh well. And sharpened up the line even more with the concealer. Oh, my eyes are burning. I have bad allergies today. Okay, come on. I'm trying to be quick with this video so it's not 31 minutes long. That's why I did one eye. Anyway, this brush is amazing for um, applying concealer. You see how that just amazingly just sharpens up the line? Yeah, that's it for now. Now I'm going to take my NYX HD Finishing Powder in Banana. And I'm hitting pan on this baby. And... Setting my under eyes, looking up or trying to as I'm setting them. So it won't crease. Because this concealer does crease like big time. But look at the highlighted look it gives you. But don't worry, we're going to fix that. Um, because I don't really like that look. I mean, I do, but once we add the bronzer and all that good shit, we'll be good to go. Okay, then I took my eyeliner. It Cosmetics Waterproof Gel Eyeliner in black. Okay, I gave my cat a bath yesterday, guys. It was the worst thing ever. She was screaming like she was being murdered. I felt so bad for her. Oh, I love this eyeliner. Okay, we're almost done because we're just, all we got to do now is primer. Priming the face with the CoverGirl primer. 
Come on, baby. I want to make this video not so dang long. But we're not going near like the concealer or anything, like the setting powder. We don't want to mess any of that up, so. Which we did, but. Oh well, that's the power of makeup, baby. Then we're going to take the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. Pump, pump, a cump, a cumple. Pump, a pump, a cumple of pumps on the back of your hand. <laughs> what the fuck? And then I'm taking the It. See how dirty it is? I have to clean my brushes. Brushes for Ulta Complexion Brush and patting this into my skin. And once we get this foundation on, it will fix like the lightness because I really don't like that look a lot of people do but I don't I ain't about that life people I mean I like the highlighted look but for my cheeks you know what I mean not for concealer Oh yeah, I love this Urban Decay palette. This is probably the best one they have made yet. Are you kidding me? Is there really... Are people actually fucking doing shit? If they are, I'm gonna be pissed. Oh. Okay, we're done with that. Now we're going to set the face. Where's my powder? I forgot my powder. <laughs> I guess I'm just going to have to use, I'm just going to use one of these powders. It doesn't matter because as long as it's a powder, it's going to work. You know what I mean? Just have to set it. Ta ta, we are almost done, people. Last night I was playing with the Lorac Mega Pro 2 palette, creating all these looks, and I came up with a really good one. So I can't wait to do a tutorial with that. Okay, now we're going to go in with the Lorac Pro Contour Kit, we're almost done, and we're going to take the Medium Contour, I contour low, a lot of people contour high, but I do like to do it low. Because then I like to do the bronzer, like bronzing up my face, you know what I mean? I'm just shaping it out where I want it to be. Yatata, yatati. Then we are going to blend it out. Some people contour differently. This is how I fucking do it. Because watch in a minute, I will take another bronzer and just bronze up the face and it'll be okay. By the way, if you hear a weird noise, it's my sprinklers. My sprinkler system going off. Then I'm going to take the medium contour again and just bronze up this face. You know what I mean, people? And I do this like all over my face. Okay. Then for blush, I'm going to be using NARS's Sin.
You do not need a lot of this blush. It is so freaking pigmented. Highlighter, I am using, I have to fix this because this is just too much, Becca's Opal, I haven't used this baby in a minute. Mm-hmm. Also, people highlight differently, too. I highlight, like, that above the brow bone and I, then when I'm done I blend it all together oh kitty kitty hang on baby almost done hang on a minute my cat wants to get up and eat but I'm like I'm not done yet hang on because her food is like right by where I'm filming so we're just blending that out a little bit so it's not so harsh looking. Then, hang on kitty. You hear her meow? Oh, isn't she so cute? Oh, the cutest meow. I'm just closing up my brushes because all we have left to do is lips and we're done. So. Hang on baby. Mommy's almost done. Gotta wipe up my lip balm. Okay, so for lipstick, I'm going to use Max Cream Sheen and Cream Cup. Oh, this is one of my favorite Mac lipsticks. Oh, there is a hair like hanging off of me. <laughs> Hang on, baby. So guys, that is the completed look using the Urban Decay Vice 4 palette. Here's the look. Hang on, baby. I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and have a beautiful day. Please subscribe and don't forget to enter my giveaways. And stay tuned. I'm going to be doing swatches of that palette because I want to swatch the colors for you guys. So... Love you all. XOXO. Have a beautiful day. Thank you for watching. Bye.